GM will spend half a billion dollars to upgrade some of these machines. New technology will enable workers to produce future versions of Chevy, Cadillac, and GMC SUVs. New vehicles, new product, and with that new product, you know, people got jobs. The money probably won't create new jobs, but it offers stability for current employees and clarity about the facility's role in a changing industry. Every vehicle manufactured here runs on gasoline. But GM has announced it intends to eventually move to all electric production meaning this investment is significant for this plant. It ensures these Arlington workers will continue making these fuel-powered or ICE vehicles at least into the next decade. Our company leaders have been very transparent about what the vision of General Motors is over the next 15 to 20 years. Um, ICE vehicles play a critical role in enabling what our longer term vision is. That's good news for Tarrant County, where GM is the largest industrial taxpayer and among the largest employers. Workers built 34,000 SUVs here in March. With this $500 million investment, it will be an even stronger economic engine for Tarrant County. GM executives would not speculate about long term plans for the plant like whether it could eventually become a manufacturing hub for electric vehicles. They only offered this instruction. So I would tell you, stay tuned. In Arlington, I'm Matt Houston.